As the long season gets closer to its finale, the Cougars are back at Trustmark Park to play for a state championship for the second year in a row. You're gonna write a book, okay, this is where it begins. A best of three series, Northwest Rankin getting set to take on DeSoto Central. Good evening, everyone. Welcome inside the booth. Josh West alongside my partner, Cliff Barker. Cliff, this is as good of a series between these two teams as you will see anywhere in the country this year. So many workouts. I knew you were going to be back, and I think you've got a lot of y'all back here. And I think this time we're more prepared mentally. I think we're more prepared physically. Y'all know what to expect here, and I'm expecting us to come out here and handle the situation, and handle this, and get this up to you, okay? Slow everything down, and be confident in what we do, okay? I think the pressure's a little bit more on them right now, but I want us to play loose. That's a big thing with us last year. We came out here, we got a little sped up. We tried to do a little bit too much. We don't have to do too much tonight. We've got to do what we've done all year long. Nobody's got to be super human. We've got to fill our roles, we've got to do our job, we've got to pick the next guy up, pass that baton like Coach says, let's find a way to get this thing going. So, be your own coach, okay, be your own coach. Know, know where the gaps are, know where the outfielders are, know if they're shallow, know if they're deep, okay, because it's, it's going to play a huge, huge difference in this ball game, okay. So pay attention, be dialed in wherever you are, all right. Um, Again, Coach, like I said, damn proud of it, okay? I'm, I'm, I'm so pumped for you guys. You deserve it. Okay, like I told y'all last, uh, last week, the, 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 the number on my hat, 6'5", that, that was almost a year ago, guys, where we left here, you know, pissed off, you know, broke, heartbroken, okay? All right, and guys, I know, I know what you're thinking, okay? You think you're going to win a state championship in front of this crowd, all right? You won a state championship when this happened, okay? That's when you won the state championship. You've been working your tail off, and you earned it. You deserve it, okay? Don't let them take it. All right, we talked about building a legacy, writing your book, okay? You finished that book tonight, you write it in a stone. Okay, you hit me today, man, when I was playing with my little kid, okay? In about five, six years, when he starts coming through this program, in 10 years when he's trying out for this team, okay? He's gonna, he's gonna remember y'all, okay? He's gonna remember this team that built the legacy at Northwest Franklin, that, that home banners, okay? And I couldn't be more, more stoked for my kid to look up to y'all. Okay, I got a text message this morning from a, from a friend of mine that's a parent, and the and the and the picture was there's a picture of the kid and it said what I love about my, my last day of school, my favorite things to do, and it said, My favorite thing to do is go watch Evan Rogers play baseball. He's my favorite baseball player. Guys, I get chill bumps. I got chill bumps this morning. I sent it to his parents, okay? That's the kind of kid, that's the kind of player y'all are, okay? That's the kind of eyes that are watching y'all, okay? And I love it, man. I can't wait to go to war with you, okay? This is our field! Let's go! You run it! Now listen to me. Nick, you've been in charge of this bus the whole year of game one, okay? You've done a hell of a job driving, son. You understand me? Yes, Lord. Here's your key to the bus. Drive us home, bro. Let's go! Let's go.
Sticking to their winning rotation, the Cougars would send senior ace Nick Monastere to the hill for game one. Setting the tone early, senior Evan Rogers got things going with a single. 2-1, and it's a line drive towards center field. It'll loop in for a base hit. So Rogers got his pitch, and he singles it into center field. The Cougars would continue to find base runners, scoring five in the first inning. The Mississippi State. Brock Tapper, who would be the game two starter, is as well, and there's a base hit. One run is in. The stop sign at third, the big turnaround first. But Brady Thomas comes through with an RBI single. Pitch runner going for first, and this one's hammered into the gap in left center field. This one's heading for the wall. Two runs will score. Munson May is rounding second. He's flying for third. The relay is not in time. Called strike three as Brassfield goes down looking on strikes. Chasing the starter early, the Cougar lineup would work the Jaguar bullpen all game.
Here's a line drive, center field, well struck, but right to Herbison for the out. Heading into the last two innings of the game, the Cougars would bring in Ryan Herbison to close the door. until they stop, okay? So make sure you come out here ready to go and, and let's get after their tail, all right? Hey, we gotta, we gotta come through, you know, a couple, couple of those hits, we really had a chance to, to do it. But again, I'm proud of you, great game. This is our field. Nick, I'm gonna need them bus keys back and hand them off to Connor. Hey, well okay? guess what? what? Let's let them throw that way, hey, hey, hey. Guys, when you get done, when you break it down, wrist hey, 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 those on me, those on three, one, two, three, go! Oh, man, I mean, it felt pretty rough, not going to lie. Last weekend when they did, when I didn't get to pitch, but I was close to door, so it was my time to shine, and when I came in, I did my job, and the scoreboard says the rest of it. Three batters, three strikeouts. What's the mindset going in tomorrow? Oh man, just stay confident and just, you know, keep playing the way we're supposed to play. Connor's going to give us a chance to win. We just got to come up with those timely hits and finish it off, man. Keep playing confidence and play Northwest baseball. It gets you rashes, then it's fake. You need to lock allergic in. To That's what you need. No you need to lock in. You need to lock in. <laughs> no, both of us go home. Okay. I will go home and carry this team by myself. <laughs> Ain't that the truth, bro? Yeah, sure did yesterday, didn't you? Yeah. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, Evan Rogers is mic'd up. Hey, you gotta push the button. Dude, come on. Dude, why are you not gonna tell me that my thing is unbuttoned?
I thought you wanted them, but Dude, you look good. No, I always want to look good. If there ever a time I look bad, you have to tell me. All right. Well, you don't ever look bad, so I got to tell you. <laughs> That was a good one, I ain't gonna lie. Hey, can we get rolling, baby? <laughs> Why would you have a bobblehead in your truck? That's freaking hideous. God, man. I like the bobbleheads. Bobbleheads, dude, no. You gotta show up to the ballpark. Dude, no. Bobblehead night, yeah. <laughs> well, they hand out free ones? <sighs> yes, sir, boys. Y'all ready to roll? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. You're not stressed enough. Hey, what if you come in and run for us? Bro. People these days, I'll tell you. It just, Whenever we did our high-five thing, I had to make sure I hit the opposite pocket. Yeah, well, they're trying to bully him, man. It's just, you know, really getting out of hand. Are you bullying Peyton right now? Hey, don't tell him, but he is terrible at throwing. You own something? It's hot out here. They're never going to expect it. They're going to think that I'm going yard. I'm just not. Gosh, I got the best arm in the country. He's lucky I'm six foot. That's a routine right here every day, every day. One more, one more, through the legs. Let's go! Let's go, baby! Hey, Kyle. Let's go, baby. It's gonna be a good day, it's gonna be a good day. So, what's your thing? I do. What's she gotta say? Come on, let the people know. Let the people know. I'll let them know in a little bit. Oh, okay, you just gonna keep it in the low? It's time. go time. It's go time, oh yeah. Oh yeah. Go time, baby! Okay, I've never, like I told y'all yesterday, we've never lost any confidence. Y'all, y'all are ready for this. There's no doubt about it. We've known it. Y'all are ready for it. Y'all know that. Go out here, let's get them on business. Jump on them early. Let's get more energy for them. Shut the door early. Let's get this thing done. Yes, let's keep putting pressure on. They did not handle it well. They threw that ball around like a little, like a little league team last night. Okay, guys, you don't have to, you don't have to do anything special tonight. Okay, you be you, you be you. Um, I have all the confidence in the world for you, okay? You didn't got to be the baddest man on the planet. You just got to be the baddest man in the stadium tonight, okay? Okay? If a pit bull bites you, he's never letting go. All he's going to do is bite harder, okay? So you got to grip him right now and you keep squeezing, okay? All right. Today's presentation is South State Championship, okay? We worked our tails off for this, okay? Uh, this was not our goal, though, okay? This was just this was just one of the stepping stones on the way to this. You understand that, okay? We're not going to be satisfied with this. We didn't come this far to be second place. You understand that? We're going to keep grinding, okay? We're going to put pressure on them, and we're going to come out victorious, okay? Y'all know what I think about this trophy? Yeah! Hey boys, hey listen to me. All seven innings. Hey, that's just the game. Guess what? You know what time it is. Let's let their throats. Let's go! Because I think it's a good one. Yes! Making his 13th start of the year, senior Connor Brooks would be the game two pitcher. Facing another top arm in the state, the Cougars would struggle early and were down 4-0 in the bottom of the second. Good time. 
Let's go two. Ready to get a score right there. Evan, Evan, let's go. Let's go. See what he's doing? I mean, yeah. You do Dulick or you do one. You switch the yeah. All right. Turn him up. So, do one look. Straight one look. Hey, you got to get it, you though. You got to be sure of it. Like, guarantee you. He's a 160 high legs. And if you don't. Well, they're, they're going to kick the damn thing around. Let's go. Let's go. Hit well, high and deep to left field. This is crushed, and it is a one hopper off the wall. Two runs are in. Monastere flying into third with a stand up two RBI triple. It was almost a ground rule double, but the top of the fence kept it in, and it's a 4 2 ball game. That ball was absolutely crushed. Monastere got all of it. That Oh, he's asking, did the ball go over the fence and bounce back? He just did a motion with his hand. This game just got a whole lot more interesting. Yes. I, I threw up my hand. I thought it got out and, and, and came back. I never, I never looked. It was a weird, it was a weird look. But I think it hit down there. It hit something hard. I saw him turn and his shot back. straight back. And I threw my hand up. I mean, it's, it's tough to see that, but I thought he went over. I mean, it's a tough call, obviously. I saw him turn his back, so I was watching. Yeah, 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 yeah. Sure, sure, sure. That's a ball that's a home run in every high school baseball park in the state of Mississippi. And a no-doubter. I mean, it is. That's a home run. Don't get too much. Behind you right here, okay? Make sure we're getting dirty on double play. Come on, run here, please. Was that a call? Hey, was that a cold strike? Or did he say he went because the catcher was Let's go home, come on! Cutting the lead in half would keep the Cougars within striking distance, along with the help of Connor Brooks fighting back on the mound.
found themselves in a situation they were not used to and realized they would soon be in a decisive game three. We said all along it's never going to be easy, right? We're going to have to earn it anytime we do it, okay? And tonight, I'll, I'll be honest with you, we didn't earn it, okay? And so that's just, that's part of baseball sometimes. It's not our night. Sometimes we just, you know, we didn't make the plays when we needed to to get out of an inning. They give them credit. They got a couple of hits right there and were able to stretch the lead and took advantage of the mistakes that we gave, okay? I thought we did a pretty good job of fighting our way back into it right there. Just didn't get a big hit right there. That one opportunity where we had an opportunity to to maybe uh, tie it or take the lead right there. And, and you know, that's baseball. Sometimes they're gonna make the pitches that they need to, okay? So what we have to do though is remember whose, whose side we're on, all right? We have each other's backs no matter what happens, all right? We're going to war. There ain't nobody I'd rather go to war with than you guys right here, okay? So tomorrow we're gonna strap it on and we're gonna give it everything we got, all right? A band of brothers that is, has each other's back and puts 100% of effort the whole time, all game. No pointing fingers. Hey, that's a team loss right there. Okay, a team loss. Coaches, players, all of us. We'll all wear it. You got me? And tomorrow, whenever we step out on this field, hey, it's seven innings for everything that, that we set our goals for. Seven innings. So I better get your, get your best. That's all I want. Seven innings of full focus, getting after it, 100% effort, all right? So go home tonight, get some rest, and let's come here to finish a job that we started a year ago, to probably close to a year ago today, all right? Let's finish the job tomorrow. Come out here, compete our tails off, and be ready to play some baseball. We good? Um, I ain't got a whole lot, because uh, that sucks. I'm gonna throw up right now, okay? There's some things I think we could have done probably during the game and made a little difference. I probably should have sent Tucker there, but Second, second, third, no outs, I'll take it. The ball was this far from going to the corner. It's just, it's just our night, not our night. It sucks. And bad as we played, as a whole, collectively, we were still one swing away right there from winning. If we get a hit there in the sixth, uh, Herbertson would have come in and slammed the door. There's not a doubt in my mind. Okay, I think Connor did a hell of a job battling back, fighting through some things and giving us a chance to win right there. He didn't have his best stuff early. I challenged right there on the third inning, and he stepped up and, and he, he pissed his tail off there. Okay, he gave us a chance. We just got to get that hit when it comes. And we, we had them all night, guys. I think we had them in the second inning, the fourth inning, the fifth, and the sixth. We just didn't get that hit. Okay, and tomorrow we will. Okay, um, it's going to suck for a minute. Okay, you're probably not going to sleep real great tonight, but try to. All right, flush it. Come back with some energy tomorrow. Okay, come back with the energy. Be focused with one goal. Guys, we ain't, we ain't going to lose two nights in a row, two days in a row. It just ain't going to happen, okay? Let's finish it tomorrow. See, hey, seniors, seniors, show me some leadership. Let's get everybody ready and let's go, okay? Three, two, three, one, two, three. Cougars! Cougars!